It's great to be here together with Thomas and the team from Save the Children India for the launch of our global report on a life free from hunger. This is the latest in our campaign to save the lives of every one of those children who die from preventable causes before their fifth birthday. And as we know, a third of all those deaths are because of children not getting the right nutrition. And for the children who do survive, they grow up stunted. And here in India, the shocking fact is nearly half of all children in India are suffering from malnutrition or, or yes, stuntedness. Sir. As this report uh, very clearly says that uh, uh, if you don't do anything in the first two years or the first thousand days of a child's existence on this earth, most of what is going to happen is going to be irreversible condition. And the report also says that uh, about uh, 15 points dip in the IQ level for children as they grow up. And uh, that is going to be, even economically, it's going to be a disaster uh, for a country like India because we are going to lose out on our productivity uh, of, uh, of these children when they grow up. What are you doing about this, Thomas? What we are advocating for, it, uh, for this issue in India is that a mission focused on malnutrition should be housed under the Vice President uh, of India who, will, who has the convening power of various ministries to make sure that this, this happens and also allocation of adequate budgets uh, for this to happen. I can just see um, some children over here being measured and yes. it's important I think for us to really get the message across that children can end up stunted physically and but also mentally their, their development is, is affected and I think you know this is a really very much a hidden crisis because I think people don't realize what the long-term impact is for children if they don't get treatment before the age of two so it's great to see as you say save the children actually doing something at the point of delivery here but also advocating to make sure that there really is a, a home for nutrition here in, in India great to know that all around the world as we're here this report is being launched in many many other cities and and places around the world because I think there's about half a billion children the report talks about over the next 15 years who will grow up stunted um, and other children will lose their lives because of not having the right food to eat unless action is taken.